Hello boys and girls, welcome back to the Watch Horn. It's been a while, I know, I'm sorry. Uh, so I've had the 6 arc, and I had this Vortex on it. It's a Vortex Viper, 6x24x50, and I just, I, I did drop a couple coyotes. I'll have our smoking hot editor lady drop a picture or two in but i just god i don't like it it's uh just something about it doesn't feel right so i went ahead and swapped out for a leopold vx5 hd with the zero stop that's a big deal if you're dialing and uh, well, I'm going to re-zero it with that. And the other exciting part about it that I care about is I scored a couple of these ODG Duramags. 100% American made. And I got them from Stars Forward Armament. Good dudes there. So if you're looking for nice quality products check out stars forward armament they didn't pay me to say that or give me anything except for a couple stickers when i bought them but you'll probably get the stickers too everybody loves good stickers so anyway i'm gonna re-zero with these mags we're at 25 yards you know the norm but i really want to see how these uh, duramags feed and if uh if I can get any better groups out of it, because I've heard that mags do have an effect on accuracy. I don't know. So, we'll give a, a rough quick zero here at 25. Be about an inch and a half low or so. And we'll move back up to 100. Holy moly, that's way high. Start out on AR-500 target right there. Aiming dead center to see if we can hit it. And we hit it dead center. You can see over here on the paper, Crazy Ivan did zero his rifle a little bit ago. And he left me a lot of paper to work with. So we're going to go center mass. Or the center dot. One. Two. Three. Safety on. Let's go see where we ended up. All right. So 25 yards. There's our three-shot group. Um, looks like I could go about a click back to the right, but that's good enough to move back to a hundred and we'll fine tune from there. That'll do. So these are what I started out with. They are labeled long load six arc. And these are the 20 round Duramags. I'm definitely liking the Duramax. And ODG, it is just, everybody loves it. That's not to, to shame on the long loads, but they're just, capacity's king, even for coyotes. So, here we go, back at 100 yards, trying to get our zero. I'm going to go ahead and zoom way in to 15 power. I'm going to send one more. That one's about three inches high and about an inch and a quarter left. That one's just three inches high. Uh, 
Okay. So, we are gonna get back on a point of aim and walk the crosshairs right back up to where our impact is. Back on that point of aim and click her back over to where we're hitting. So going back down to the center diamond. All right, that's a five shot group that I'm not mad about. Let's go down and take a look at that. Okay, so these first three shots were just off of our 25 yard zero. We adjusted, and this is where we ended up with our five shot group. That's, that's solid. Uh, if I wasn't so cheap, I would buy that ballistic calculator app. And that would probably come up as about point, I'm going to say point six six, point six five, somewhere in there, just eye in it, because it goes off center of impact, center of impact. So all I'm going to do is I'm just going to click her over to the right a little bit, which would be, so when you're adjusting a scope, you're you're moving the bullet so it'll be moving the bullet back to the left and i'm going to give it two clicks and i'm done this will put us right at three quarters to an inch low at 100 and we'll be within that to 300 yards pretty much anywhere in there and that will definitely smoke a coyote i am happy with that awesome Thanks for putting up with another zeroing video. I appreciate you. Now you go zero your optics. Get your ass to the range. Go. Quit looking at me. Go. Go. Get out of here.